I actually lived across the road from Daniel Johns when I lived in Newcastle at Merriweather. So no, no relation. No relation. We yeah. lived across the road, so uh, knew him pretty well. When we won the 1997 Grand Final in 1997, <laughs> funny enough, Andrew, uh, the morning after, broke into Daniel Johns' house at 5 o'clock in the morning, <laughs> climbed up through the bedroom. Yeah, true story. <laughs> went down and serenaded him with body and soul, I'm a freak, I'm a freak, and then dragged Daniel Johns out to Mad Monday. Mm. Poor kid. He, he was about 16, 17. I've never seen someone look so uncomfortable in the life. He stuck out like a white cow in a bog. It was un... Everyone was saying, come on, mate, sing us a song. And he was going, oh, okay, what do you want to hear? k San or something for the angels. Oh, gosh, I don't really know that. <laughs>